Hey there, this is Bob Warfield with CNC Cookbook. In this video, I want to walk you through the first time setup for our G-Wizard Feeds and Speeds calculator. It's super easy, so it won't take very long. Here we go. First thing you want to do when you get it installed is go ahead and, and log in. And you do that just by clicking on the login button, enter the email you registered with, and you'll be logged in. It's going to ask you to accept the license agreement, no worries. And so here you are, you're logged in. Okay, so we're going to go through the step by step process. You enter what units you'd like, inches or millimeters. You can change anything we're going to do here in the setup tab, but this is all about your first time setup. The next thing is to go ahead and set up your machine. G Wizard needs to know just a couple of things about your machine so that it can. Uh, Make sure it generates feeds and speeds that are appropriate to the machine. So first thing I want you to do is click this box in order to select the machine. Now, there's a bunch of predefined machines here. Uh, if you see your machine on the list, great. You can just click it and go from there and you don't have any more setup to do. Uh, but if you need to go ahead and set up a machine, that's pretty easy too. Uh, pick one of these generic machines, either a milling machine, a router, or a lathe. Um, click the OK. It says, was your machine on the list? If it was, go ahead and click this and you're done. But if not, go through and you just have to answer these few questions. So I'm just going to go ahead and, and uh, enter a, a machine. I'm going to put in uh, Bob's Tormach PCNC 1100M. Uh, it's a Tormach. The model is 1100M. Um, Type is a milling machine. There's three types, mills, routers, and lathes. Okay, let's keep going. Then I just need to know a couple of things about the machine. I need to know its maximum RPM that it'll go. So I don't I think that's 7,000 on that machine. I'm just working off the top of my head. The minimum is zero. Uh, spindle power, it's got two horsepower. And the maximum feed rate is 90 inches a minute. That's all G-Wizard needs to know. And you can find out that stuff either by looking in your owner's manual uh, searching the website of the company that makes your machine or contacting your machine people. But with that said, you're all done, you're ready to go, and here we are. This is what the generic uh, setup looks like if you need to add more machines, but, you know, assuming you've just got the one machine, you're ready to go. That's it. Thanks.